Imagine a tiny lonely traveler, Voyager 2, flung from its home by a slingshot of gravity, sailing past the giants of our solar system. For nearly 50 years it's carried our hopes and greetings, etched onto a golden record, into the cosmic ocean. This probe has been our eyes and ears in the dark, whispering back secrets that have reshaped our understanding of the universe. But now, something extraordinary has happened. On July 18th, 2025, after years of fading power, Voyager 2 sent a final unexpected burst of data to Earth. It wasn't a goodbye or a shutdown, it was a puzzle, a jolt to the scientific community. This last message traveled over 14 billion miles taking more than 22 hours to reach us. It's a testament to human ingenuity that we can even hear such a faint signal from so far away. What could a dying probe, with less power than a refrigerator light bulb, possibly have to say that could change everything? Voyager 2 is our only emissary in a region never before explored. Its final message isn't about the planets it left behind, but about the universe that lies ahead. It's a story of cosmic radiation, magnetic fields, and the very nature of the interstellar medium. This is the final chapter that forces us to reconsider the boundaries of our solar system, and what lies beyond. Let's rewind to 1977, when NASA launched Voyager 2 on a grand tour of the outer planets. Using a rare planetary alignment, Voyager 2 visited Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune, an audacious mission that turned points of light into real, dynamic worlds. It revealed Jupiter's storms, Saturn's rings, Uranus's tilted axis, and Neptune's mysterious moon, Triton. Each encounter sent back postcards from the frontier, rewriting textbooks and igniting imaginations. After Neptune, Voyager 2 continued outward, crossing the heliopause in 2018, the boundary where the sun's influence ends and interstellar space begins. Its aging instruments kept sending data about plasma, magnetic fields, and cosmic rays from this unexplored region. Voyager 2 became our first true interstellar probe, a silent sentinel reporting from the great beyond. Its journey far exceeded its original mission, showing us a solar system more wondrous than we ever imagined. Now as it drifts further, its legacy is the data it sends from the space between the stars. Each bit of information is a message from the edge of the unknown. Voyager 2's odyssey is a testament to human curiosity and perseverance. Its story is not just about where it's been, but where it's going. And now, its final message promises to change everything we thought we knew. For years, Voyager 2's signals grew fainter as its power source decayed. NASA engineers performed miracles, shutting down instruments, turning off heaters and stretching every watt to keep the probe alive. Communication slowed to a crawl, with each command taking nearly a day to reach the spacecraft, and another day for a reply. By mid-2025, silence was inevitable. The world watched as the last signals sputtered, preparing to say goodbye to an old friend. Then, the unexpected, on July 18, 2025, after days of silence, a powerful burst of data arrived. It was stronger and more complex than anything received in the past year. The team at JPL was stunned. Was it a malfunction or something more? The race to decode this final enigmatic message began immediately. Voyager 2, in its last act, had gathered its remaining strength for one final shout across the cosmos. The world held its breath, waiting to learn what secrets this last transmission might reveal. The silence was broken, not with a farewell, but with a mystery. The story was far from over. July 18, 2025. At the Canberra Deep Space Complex, Voyager 2's signal suddenly reappeared, stronger than anyone thought possible. The data burst lasted nearly 10 minutes defying all expectations for the dying probe. Dr. Suzanne Dodd, Voyager project manager, described the moment. We thought it was an error, the signal was far stronger than our models predicted. Diagnostics confirmed it was real. Voyager 2 had sent a final historic message. The data was immediately sent to scientists worldwide. It wasn't just from the plasma instrument, it included readings from the magnetometer, cosmic ray subsystem, and plasma wave instrument, all thought to be long dormant. The data was compressed using an old algorithm last used during the Neptune encounter. The world watched as experts raced to decode the message. NASA quickly clarified, this was not a message from aliens but from our own spacecraft. Yet the content was baffling, unlike anything received before. What was Voyager 2 trying to tell us about the environment it had entered? This was a final gift, a scientific puzzle from the edge of interstellar space. The countdown to understanding had begun. Decoding the message was monumental, requiring old archives, retired engineers and a global effort. The data was a snapshot from a region of space we barely understand. 
Magnetometer readings showed a dramatic increase in the interstellar magnetic field, far beyond predictions. Cosmic ray data revealed a spike in high-energy particles, flowing from a specific direction, channeled by the intense field. Dr. Ed Stone called it truly remarkable, evidence of the galaxy's magnetic structure on a local scale. The plasma wave instrument detected a persistent low-frequency hum, stable, pure, and oscillating in a complex pattern. Some theorize it's the resonance of a dense plasma cloud, others suggest more exotic origins. The final analysis Voyager 2 had crossed a new boundary, a dense, highly magnetized sheet of plasma, possibly the edge of a vast interstellar cloud. The message was both a warning and a revelation. It showed that the universe beyond our solar bubble is wild and complex. Voyager 2's last report is a glimpse of the cosmic weather just outside our door. The data challenges everything we thought we knew about interstellar space. The frontier is stranger and closer than we imagined. Voyager 2's final message has upended our understanding of the local interstellar medium. The discovery of a dense magnetized structure just outside our heliosphere means our solar system's journey through the galaxy is anything but smooth. This could affect everything from satellite safety to future missions beyond Earth. The heliosphere, our protective shield, may be compressed as we enter this new region, allowing more cosmic radiation to reach us. Scientists now face urgent questions. What is this structure? How will it impact our solar system? Voyager 2's discovery will drive research and new missions for years to come. Its final whisper is a Rosetta Stone, connecting interstellar space to the history of life on Earth. Beyond science, Voyager 2's message is a mirror to humanity. This tiny machine built by human hands has traveled farther than any of us ever will, a symbol of our curiosity and ambition. Its story unites people across the globe, reminding us we are all passengers on a small planet in a vast cosmos. The questions it raises, are we alone, what is our destiny, transcend borders and politics. Voyager 2 proves that the pursuit of knowledge is never a waste, it inspires new generations and gives us perspective on our place in the universe. Its message is a challenge to be more curious, more cooperative, and to keep reaching for the stars. As we plan new journeys, Voyager's legacy should guide us. To understand the significance, we turn to Sir Martin Rees, the UK's astronomer royal. He calls Voyager 2's message a philosophical turning point. For all of history, we've been inside the cave, Voyager has just stepped outside. The discovery is a lesson in humility, reminding us the universe is always more complex than we imagine. Moments like these foster global consciousness and bind us together as a species. Sir Martin sees this as a call to action. Now is the time to press forward, not retreat from space. We need a successor to Voyager designed to explore this new frontier. Voyager 2 has opened a door. Now we must have the courage to step through. The future of exploration depends on our willingness to be astonished. So, where do we go from here? Voyager 2 is now silent, but its legacy endures. Its final message is a challenge to us all, a call for global cooperation and scientific ambition. The discovery of this new interstellar structure is a human achievement, not just a scientific one. Now is the time for nations to work together, pooling resources and knowledge to study this phenomenon. We need new missions, new telescopes, and new ideas. The stakes are too high for any one nation to go it alone. This is also a moment to inspire the public, parents, teachers, and citizens, to nurture curiosity and support exploration. Voyager 2 has reminded us that we are explorers by nature. The journey will be long and difficult but it is one we must take. The universe is waiting. Voyager's final message was not a farewell but an invitation, an invitation to look up, to wonder, and to continue the greatest adventure in human history. Our journey to the stars is just beginning.